Hey guys, welcome back to Infamous and Enigmatic. Oh, shit. <laughs> Cut. Hey, welcome back to Green with Andy. We're keeping that in. So anyway, we are here in uh, Franklin Park Zoo. It is a chilly 41 degrees outside. And yeah, this is uh, Sam's first time here. He's never been here. Never been. Um, if you want to check out my video on Franklin Park Zoo, you can hit up Infamous and Enigmatic. You'll see me and Lai. We were here last year when half of the exhibits were shut down. But yeah, everyone's loosened up a bit on restrictions. Zoos are back open. And still because of, well, partly because of the winter and also because of a lot of people staying home. It's a empty. lot easier to social distance. It's so. a lot, it's empty. So we don't have to spend nine hours waiting to get into the indoor enclosures right, that they we don't have, have here. to worry about you know kids walking the way or yeah it's pretty quiet too that's the other great thing nature's neighborhoods this is a brand new section they just opened this up a few years ago when my sister and i were here all right yeah i gotta get a picture of this oh wait wait it's this way Crikey! What have we got over here? Wetlands, aviary, prairie dogs, fallen tree, restrooms. That's convenient. The best part of the museum is the restroom. Yes. Ooh, red panda. Oh, there he is. He's right there. Oh, there he is. Oh my god. Oh, he's so cute. Did we see the red panda at uh, Roger Williams last year? I believe we took long enough just to um, get a good picture of him. Yeah. I'm going to warn you right now, you're probably going to be the one taking the pictures because my jacket's so reflective that... So red panda. There's the other one up there. Oh my goodness, is he sleeping? Or she? Yeah, she's sleeping. Oh! Oh my goodness. Oh, it's so cute. Hi, buddy. Definitely has no fear of traveling from branch to branch. All right, um, let's move on to the next part. All right, yeah. We're gonna have to come back over there and say hi to them. There's prairie dogs in here somewhere. I can't move my hand. There must be birds in here. Otherwise, I wouldn't have had two gates. What the hell? Yeah, there's your answer. Yep. Bird oh, look at the bird. Look at the dinosaurs. Wow. Crikey. Look at all those dinosaurs. The one closest to us, I love those white stripes on their back. Actually, a lot of them, it's just, yeah. the patterns are gorgeous. Some of them, I noticed how some of them have like corn bills and some of them have like ladder bills. Yes. Oh, there's the crane. Big bird over there. Oop. All right, let's um, back away before you get splashed. Yeah, I don't, I don't like getting splashed in winter. You know, water's probably pretty cold. Yep, probably. Nice. Oh, they act 
actually have web really cool feet. Okay, you can see them right Hey guys, so what we have here is a wild ass. It's not the official term. Yeah, well. We're not quite sure what they are, but they are very pretty. I, there's a way to check later. I don't have the thing on me because I'm filming. Hmm. Oh, you were supposed to, we were supposed to go in this way. Oh, it is open. Good. Giddy up, griddle. That place has really good steak and cheese. Pull. Start in here so I can take pictures from here at least. Hey, buddy. Really cool. Look at here. It's so cool. Hello, Mr. Capricorn. Oh, buddy. Oh, come back. I think at this point you're out of luck. Yeah. Okay. Push. Okay. Go. How could I already be losing battery? Are you kidding me? Maybe he's afraid of your jacket. So cool. Okay. Now we need to figure out how to get out of here. So what we have here is a waddled crane. Pretty things, ain't they? No, do you inhabit Sahara in Africa? So yeah, there are the animals. I don't see any ostriches out today. That's really disappointing. I don't blame them. It's a bit cold for that. Uh, giraffe savanna. Yeah, I don't think we're going to be seeing any giraffes today. There's the uh, play area. Wow, some of them. Yeah. I think they know how to keep these kids entertained. Really. I know, right? That wasn't open the last time I was here. That whole section was cordoned off. Oh, wait, wait. I see at least one. A zebra. Or a zebra. Ah. There he is. You let me take a picture of you. Oh, wow. You're beautiful. What we've got here is an Australian emu. A ratite. Is it emu or emu? Emu. Emu. That's what we're say. One of the largest flightless birds on earth. Why am I speaking in an Australian accent? Because you like emu. Yes, I do emu. like emu. There's the other emu. What the hell is going on over here? Construction. Probably of a new exhibit. I hope that they're not, uh... They didn't shut that down. Well, how do you think they make the exhibit, you know? 
No, I just, I hope that the trouble... Kookaburra. No, it's not. Very unfortunate. Oh, Sam, look. Is that a goose? It looks like it. Ah, I can't get him. Yeah, well. yeah, so really quickly, this is a kiwi. I know the quality isn't the best. but this is about the best I can do. Right, Sam? Right. We tried. What we got over here? Oh, it's a 20 frog male. There he is right there. He has a weird face. Right there. There's another one up there. Very nice, beautiful animals. Yeah, I saw those in Crikey, it's the Irwins. So what we have here is a crane. You could actually see it a few minutes ago. I wasn't sure where this was. It's a white naped crane. Yeah, I probably did some study on this when I was taking uh, conservation biology last year. Or two years ago. Wow, that was two years ago? But yes, here's the bird cage from um, my original video. Here. So it looks like it loops around, and then maybe we can go in this building. I'm not sure. All right, Sam. So what do you say? You want to get all Jurassic Park three? Yeah. I You can't alter the name? No, I can't. I didn't do it. Oh, an Andean condor. Which, named after you, or you're there after it is. You, you all right, mate? Yeah, they have huge wingspans. Oh, it doesn't say. Oh, 10 to 12 feet. Can you imagine? I don't know how long that is. There's another, there are two more, I think, over there. Yep. Hey, there's a cemetery over here. Beautiful birds. So the male has the weird thing on his head and then the female is bald. I believe the females might be larger than the males, I don't know. So this angle looks like the opposite, but you know. That's just perspective.
So, yeah, that is the full wingspan height of uh, the Andean condor that we just saw. What we got over here? That's close to this one. I got a tickle my throat. Oh, this is new. Well, right now, I've been in here before. Just not on film. <laughs> oh, okay. It's a wetlands exhibit. Hey, buddy. Wow! What? Huh? What? I probably wasn't supposed to do that. What, flash? Yeah, you're not supposed to do flash. So, we're here in the swamp. All right, Sam. Forest. Ooh, rainforest, my favorite. Nice how warm it is in here, that's for sure. See the frost right here? Yeah, I've been in here. Yep. What have we got down here? It's pretty. Oh, they're up there. Damn it. That's a toucan. It's like it's an arafari. A what? Giant arafari. I thought arafaris were monkeys. Well, apparently not. Ah, oh, the desert. Australian walking stick. Oh, there it is. Uh, crap, where did it? It's right here. There it is. Yeah, I wasn't able to get in here, in here last time. Oh, look at this. Do you know how colorful these guys are? The skink. Oh, 